Chris Forster, a uh, retrospective analysis on gallbladder cancer. Um, and in this study, uh, we looked at gallbladder cancer using the National Cancer Database. Um, and we looked at over 25,000 uh, patients um, and analyzed these patients um, from the years 2000 to 2009. Um, the National Cancer Database um, includes information on over 70% of the uh, cancer patients um, in the U.S. Um, and we looked at a number of different things. We looked at the average age of di or average um, stage of diagnosis, the most common stage of diagnosis. We looked at age, and uh, we also looked at how treatments um, varied across different insurance types. Um, we found some interesting findings. Um, stage four was the most common uh, stage at diagnosis, but the average stage was 2.56. Um, in terms of age, uh, it's generally pretty well known that gallbladder cancer is an old uh, a disease of old age, and uh, this was shown um, here as well. Uh, the majority of cases were diagnosed between the ages of 70 and 79. Um, and in looking at uh, the different insurance types and uh, types of treatment that were involved, surgery was the mainstay of treatment, uh, but the treatments also vary from uh, insurance type to insurance type. Um, of note, um, VA patients tended to uh, receive uh, more uh, no first uh, course treatment, um, and also uh, had a little bit longer time um, until they were treated as well. Um, and uh, that about wraps up my poster. Thank you for stopping by.